Hey guys, so I'm back with another video. I know I haven't been making videos for a while, but I've been wanting to, so I'm just getting back into it. So it's another Dollar Tree haul, which I am addicted to the Dollar Tree. Um, I just had to go in there today. <laughs> and really, I just went in there just to go in there. So show you the things I got. And half of it is books, which like I said in my last video, I am addicted to buying books, obsessed with it. <clears throat> excuse me so the first thing I got is another well this is a wrench an adjustable wrench but another tool for my toolbox um so that and then I got this it's a uh three in one grater and I'm hoping I can use this to uh slice potatoes with because I don't have a mandolin so hopefully this will work to slice the potatoes because I've been slicing them by hand but I'm not doing them as thin as I would want and that might be easier then I got this uh, the home store it's the carpet f uh, refresher uh, foam and it says that it uh, neutralizes odors and no vacuum is needed and it says spring fresh and I smelled it in the store and it smelled pretty good it smells like fresh flowers so I'm use that on the carpet and see how that works. And then I got um, luminescence uh, <clears throat> incense sticks, and they're 40, and it's in the fresh linen, and that smells really good. Uh, when I went home, I bought an incense burner, so just decided to get that. And then I bought two glasses like this. These are the stemless wine glasses, which I have some a glass set like this, but mine are smaller. I'm going to take this off because what I'm going to do is, and I bought two, I purchased two. I'm going to take this sticker off. I'm going to look online how to get it off without it um, sticking, you know, with getting all that residue. And then what I'm going to do is paint these. <clears throat> I have some glass paint. And I've been wanting, I have been looking for these since last May. And what I want to do what I'm going to do is like decorate this. And I have an idea I wanted to take a pencil with the eraser. And then I'll decorate it. But I'm going to do a video showing you all that. So be looking out for that video. And now to the books, which is always my favorite. So I got seven books. And yesterday I had six books. And then a couple of days before that I bought one. So I just bought 14 books in like a week, which is ridiculous. But So the first book is called The Language of Trees. And this is uh, a novel by Eileen Ruby. And it says that it's about it's about um, a lady that returns back to her hometown. And it's kind of like a romance love story. Also like a mystery though. Because there's a child that went missing. And somehow I guess she's related to it. So this will be interesting. And then this is called or Happiness Sold Separately. And this is by Lolly Winston. <coughs> This is, it says, a touching comic tale. This is, uh, Eleanor Mackey has always done the right things in the right order. College, law, school, corporate career, happy marriage. Then one morning she picks up the telephone and learns that her husband is having an affair. So that'll be interesting. This United States of America by Harry Turtle Dove. And it's about, it says, caught in an explosive war between states. Can two teens survive and make their way back home? And then it says, different alternate realities of Earth. Like, they're going to be traveling through that. So, this sounds like it might be interesting. Kind of reminds me, I don't know, I was thinking like the Hunger Games, even though this clearly isn't like that. But, I don't know. So, we'll see if that's good. The next book is called Old Girlfriends. This is a book of short stories. And this is by David Updike. And I guess it's just stories about like his old girlfriends. I don't know, but that looked fun. This book is called Syndrome E. And it says that it is um, Lucy Hindenbell, single mother and beleaguered detective, has just about enough on her plate with one daughter in the hospital and another off at summer camp where she receives a panic call from an ex-lover. So he's developed a case of hysterical blindness after watching an obscure uh, film. So this is going to be a mystery. It says in the film there's subliminal messages. So that, that seemed like that might be interesting. Uh, 
this next book is called Friday Nights and it is by Joanna Trollop or Trollope and it has a reading group guide inside but yeah so this book is about says Joanna Trollope's warm, insi warm insightful novel stars Eleanor who in a chance encounter invites two young mothers into her home and slowly begins to connect with them and their friends so it just seems like an interesting book and then the last book is called Oh Juliet and this is by Robin Maxwell so this is a uh, uh, kind of like I guess this Arthur wrote a book that's supposed to be about uh, Juliet from Romeo and Juliet. So this will be interesting to read. And that is my Dollar Tree haul. So I'm getting ready to uh, do a hair video. So you should be looking out for that if you're interested in natural hair. Look out for that within the next couple of days or next week. Thank you guys. Bye.